So guys, I am back with another Power World video. And in this video, guys, I'm going to showcase you guys my very first base. I'm going to give you a tour of it. I've been hit up a few times on my Discord. People asking me to showcase my base. Uh, get a few ideas from it, a little bit of inspiration. So that's what I'm going to bring you guys today. How's it going, guys? My name's DPJ. And if you do enjoy the video, leave a like, it really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So you're looking for a little bit of inspiration. Uh... You want to see how I'm set up myself? I'll showcase this to you guys. Now, my first base is in the location I've told everybody to put their first base. I mean, you don't have to, obviously. I think it's a great spot. It's right near the very first um, fast travel point, the plateau beginnings, where he's literally spawning in that room up there. I suggested to people come out and build in this area here because there's loads of stones, loads of wood, loads of berries. So, yeah, so this is my base. And as you can see, it's all stone. Now, what I will say is as well, you guys know I had early access. Uh, but there's actually a character I created like the day before the game come out. I've gone back to him because I like the way he looks. So, yeah. So, yeah, this will all be updated. It ain't finished, by the way. It's just a quick tour of what I've done, why I've done it. So, yeah. So, as you can see, it's all locked in. This will eventually all be metal. So, yeah. Okay, so, starting left-hand side. We have my ranch. And, obviously... Your pals will drop you their certain said materials if they have that farming trait. Now this one here drops me that cloth that I need, high quality cloth. I got eggs from eggs from the chicken, wherever that is. I get milk from a cow. Not sure what this dude does. I'll put it here for some reason though. So that's my ranch. Here guys we have my two plantations. I still haven't got the tomato one up yet. Uh, but when I do I'm just going to put it in line with this one. So I've got wheat here for my flour and berries here for a few of the uh, uh, recipes as well as mainly feeding my other pals here guys we have my uh incubation lineup or my eggs i got my egg box here which as you probably well know guys if um uh, well when you build boxes in your base and you got the gatherers your power gatherers they will put things in any box it doesn't really matter but hey so yeah but that's actually my egg thingy my egg box so yeah okay so up here guys we have my mill to create my flour and we have the, um, I can't remember what this is, I thought I said it's damaged against my armor. This creates the blue rock things, I can't remember what they're called, but either or. And I put a box in between because you can get it over in combo, that's a crusher by the way. Uh, I've got a box in between them because obviously you can get over in combo, so I just pull it straight in the box from accessing both. So I can just grab that wheat and put it straight in there if I want to. And that's got a timer on it, so that's got to go in the fridge. So yeah. Is that all the weed I was crafted out of that? What the heck? Lazy ass little... Get up here and do work. But yeah, so that's that. So as you can see, this was all uneven as well, by the way. So I had to put these foundations down. I can't deal with things that are on a wonk. I just can't deal with it. Now this is the second main gate. This takes me out into the open world down there. Now this is a bit of a bodge job, people. Because as you probably know with this game, once you create like a foundation, uh, a slanted roof down or stairs down can only attach two done my absolute nothing so I could actually probably put one there thinking about it can I do that let's have a little look let's have a little look I mean like no you can't not connected to a structure but yeah so it's in a bit of a wonk but you can go up and down it still yeah there's a couple of things like this in my, in my base where you can jump up it walk this way easier okay so yeah but other than that the entire base is surrounded by root work which is what we like to see I could actually put a secret room under here if I wanted to but I don't think there's any need so here we have my my farming pen right there around this side guys we have the uh, hot spring the, it's actually the better hot spring I can't remember what this one's called high quality hot spring right there uh, this is another route into my base and into my main building, which I'll show you in a second. Are you generating electric from there? You are. Um, so we'll go back around. The, well, my power box I put there because it's just a surrounding area. It's perfect. You can just about get to the rock. So I got all that. Get to that that like opening there. You can see on the the walls there. And so it's a perfect uh, place for it. To be honest, it's in the middle. But who really cares? I do actually need to make a box. And put that right next to that. That's a smart thing to do. 
Uh, it just needs to be a new kind of box, to be honest. But can I make the metal ones? Yes, I can. I want to get this as close to that as possible. And you'll understand why in a quick second. It's got to be in line, though. Uh, that will do there. Get to work, uh, pals. Okay, so over here we have my four chests, which I actually put down at the start. And I wanted everything nice and organized. This one's actually not badly organized. Uh, they need to go in there. But the others, there's mixed and match because, as, like I said, your pals just throw things absolutely everywhere. This is the big old machine, the power condensation menu box thing. Where obviously you can upgrade your powers by having four separate to your main one. So if you put, say, that, then I need to pick four more sheeps. I can create essence from them and basically infuse them into my Lambo here, making better. But yeah, I've only used it a few times to be honest. Still early days for me. Here we have my where you create your medicine, my repair bench, which I actually need to repair my armor, but I don't think I've got leather. Okay, I've got leather, so we'll do that. Um, up here, guys, we have this fountain here, which obviously helps with efficiency in regards to watering. This right here is in regards to mining. This one's handiwork, so if you're crafting something. This one's planting. Don't know what's that got to do with planting, but yeah, this one's obviously logging wood, that, so yeah. Here we have my statue of power, which I had to fill up that gap there. You can see the monstrosity of trying to get up and around uh, because I need to make floors because this area ain't the biggest, uh, but I can build up. So yeah, that's why that's there. We've got my fridge there where I should have. Why is there no one keeping that shit chilled? Have I put him away? I probably have because I'm an idiot. I probably have because I'm an idiot. So where are you? Uh, chill it. You do you do that shit for me. So I'm gonna put you there. You ain't doing nothing. I'm just gonna put a spare just in case. Now, I have got another big dude that does it. Or are you going over? I should go over. There we go. That's what we like to see. That's what we like to see. So yeah, because uh, obviously your berries and your wheat and your milk and stuff, um, your pals will. You can see a little trick in that gold as well. Your pals just instantly bring it over to the food box. So I can just simply grab the eggs, grab them. Grab them, grab them, and grab them. And I can just like put them in the fridge if I wanted to. If I can reach the fridge, I can't reach the fridge from there. I'm at a bit of a wrong angle. No, oh, I'm actually in the fridge. What am I talking about? Was I in the fridge just was I in the fridge to start with then? Or was I in the food box? I don't know. I'm not sure what I was in, but if I just took I think I just took them out of the fridge. <laughs> That's not what I wanted to do. I was to put them into the fridge and take them out of the food box. Again, to be honest, obviously it's early access. Yeah, we can tell that. Can I not access that? No, I might have to adjust that then. Okay, so I've got them all in like decent spots now, so I can actually get to each without them being buggy, which is so annoying. But yeah, chill box next to my food box. So again, your pals, when they collect all that food, they'll come and pull it straight into that. And then we have my cooker here, because when I'm cooking things, I can pull them straight into the fridge. Simple as that. So yeah, that's that. Now we have my logging area right here. And we also have the uh, mining area right here which obviously I've got the box right next to so I can just collect acquire all that and put it straight into the box and same with the wood because you get over encumbered so quickly so grab it I can put it straight into the box just like so and there we have it now here we have I think this is my um, my production assembly line 2 which creates your weapons and things like that if you want them and here this is the sphere assembly line which I actually need to make a few of these to be honest not gonna lie have my electric generator there we have my uh, forge here uh, a little plant there don't look at the gap we have um two high quality workbenches there high quality cloth there nice we've got my pal um gear workbench and we have the weapons workbench so and then up here guys is the main building where we all go to sleep so we've got the the beds here all the beds here, three big ones because I've got a few big tents. I've got my room there. I actually need to upgrade my bed. And then, guys, like I said, you can go out this way if you want to. Go down. Um, I actually need to finish this off. This needs to be finished off. So, yeah, I'm getting in and out of the base that way. Uh, let's go that door. You can also go around this way as well if you wanted to. Just like so. I mean, stairs in this game do my absolute heading, as I said earlier. 
But yeah, that's not too, it's a bit of a budge, but not too bad. So yeah, back in here. Now we can go upstairs and onto the roof. Now, like I said, the area ain't the biggest, so I can just build upwards. And if I need to put more things out, I can put it all out here. And pals know the way up here, which is cool. So that's good to know. So yeah, now I know a few people may be wondering, so what about ore? How am I getting my metal? Well, I actually have a second base. Because once you get your power box to a level t 9 or 10, you can create a second base. And that's what I'm doing. Now these little dudes here drop me gold. Now I'll show you the second base and where it is. It's located right there. Now if you need metal, this place is unbelievable for it. It's like 10 rocks up here and it obviously respawns over time. And I've actually not long been here. That's why I had all that metal on me. And um, picked it all up. The rocks were gone. I'm waiting for them to respawn. So yeah, they do respawn over time. Uh, so yeah, they ain't respawned yet. But there's one's respawned. But this area here is absolutely... There's probably about... I'll put footage on screen now. There's probably about... 10, maybe more rocks here. So it's wild. So I'm just going to put out my best farmers in regards to mining and gathering. So what I do is the... Obviously they mine them. And gatherers come and put them straight in these boxes. And then from here guys, I can literally access everything. So I can access the ingots from there. Grab them out of that, put them in this box. Grab them out of that, put them in that box. Or vice versa. And then while I'm standing here, I can pick them all up, take them on me. And turn them fast travel back. Even if you're over encumbered. Because if you're over encumbered, you can't move. But if you're standing next to your fast travel point, you can go back. So keep that in mind too. So you're a good miner. Um, I want a few gatherers here. You're a decent gatherer. Um, you're a decent gatherer. You're a decent gatherer as well. Now I've got a main miner here who's an absolute tank. He's also the best at igniting things that I've got. I'm trying to figure out where he is. Um, there he's right there. This guy's a beast. You're good at mining too. So are you. I'm just going to put a lot of you guys out. Mining, farming. You know what we got to do, people. Uh, you get oh you got a stage tree gathering will take you and you it's got to make sure I've got enough beds here uh, I've got 14 beds that's nice that's all we need to, that's all we really need so yeah this guy here I got is unreal this thing is unreal and I think I can make a saddle for him too I actually got lucky taming him as well got really lucky taming him you can see how fast it actually works that kindling as well so yeah it's cool yeah guys that's basically it that's basically what i do um i'm just now on the lookout for tames and powers that i haven't got and just leveling up at the same time and that is basically oh we've got eggs should we hatch these eggs and see what we've got oh dark egg let's see we have a loot moon oh well my second one of that don't recall ever seeing that i'm not gonna lie we have a ribbony, that's my first one. What we like to see. What large dark egg. We got a foul bat. I've never seen one of them either, I don't think. Yep, first one I've ever had. Nice. What we like to see. And then we have a gale claw, which is pretty cool. Um, so I'm just going to grab. Actually, you know what? I'm going to take one, two, three and four and pop in and now guys we're gonna hatch four more it's what we like to do hatch those beautiful eggs but yes guys that is basically it for my base my first base my start base i'm probably just gonna keep this active and not build up anywhere else to be honest i'm not gonna lie i like it here it's nice and simple nice and easy nice easy to defend but yeah hope you drew a little bit of inspiration from this um like I said, it's an early, early days base. Um, if I do move, it's going to be to a harder area later on. When I actually got all the right gear and stuff. But it's going to be one crazy ass move. But that's why I've built such, such a simple base on that metal mountain. Because I could just simply destroy that and build up elsewhere. I do find a better base elsewhere. So yes, there we have it guys. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you've got any way I can improve this, any ideas, do let me know. Join my Discord and hit me up there. Need to fill off all that by the way but yeah join my discord hit me up there let me know what you think i uh, appreciate the feedback and there we have it guys guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i'll see you on that next one
These guys are collecting gold for me. Nice. 58. 